Okay, so I want to make a slightly different video that's a uh, little bit off topic from the things I usually discuss. This one is more to do with science, technology and human endeavour. Um, quite a lot of my videos perhaps are about contentious or um, unpleasant things. Uh, so this is something that's definitely got a more up optimistic vibe to it. Um, it's about the news that India has successfully um, sent its orbiter Mangalyan, I think it's pronounced, to Mars. Um, this is part of the, uh, I'm just reading off the BBC website here, this is part of the Mars Orbiter spacecraft program and um, it, the incredible thing about it is it was done on a relatively modest budget of 74 million uh, dollars, the equivalent of 74 million dollars. Now that is something that is is incredible. Uh, to put that in context, it is cheaper than the budget of the film Gravity. So quite often one of the criticisms of uh, space exploration is, oh, why bother about space when we've got so many problems at home? But that's one of the great things about this, is that it was a relatively modest budget. Um, Prime Minister Modi was at Bangalore at the control station and he is shared in his country's um, collective jubilation. This is great for India, but one point I would like to make is that uh, whilst space exploration is something of a, a competitive issue because countries want to be the first to do it, um, there shouldn't be too much focus on that. Although, of course, Indians have every right to be proud, but I'd like to make the point that it is a human achievement. Um, India has led the way, but it is a human achievement, and it's it's great news for science and technology. Um, already some in images are transmitting back. There's images from the constro control station at Bangalore, men and women celebrating, the scientists. All around, I think it's just good news, and it's something that should be welcomed. Um, and the images that are sent back already are very, uh, very interesting. I'll put a few links to that. Um, if you're Indian, uh, this is a day for you to celebrate. Uh, this isn't to say that there aren't problems that can be dealt with on the ground. Of course, there are. The world's not a perfect place. India is not a perfect country. But for once, this is good news, and I think it is something that uh, humanity can collectively celebrate. So congratulations to India. This is a good day for science, for technology, for space exploration, just in general. Uh, let me know your thoughts. Cheers.